What's up, my grub lovers? Who ready to get their grub on? You know what I am. It's your boy, Mr. Grub, back again with another video for you guys. And today, I'm gonna jump into some soul food, man. It's 60 degrees outside, so you know for me, I'm freezing. Um, so I need something to warm me up, man. So I'm gonna head over here to CNC Soul Food in Fort Pierce, man. Get me some good old soul food. Uh, I don't even know what I want. Whatever it is, got to have greens in it. So I'm gonna go ahead over there, man. Place my order. Get me something to eat. Let you guys check it out, man. Put them to the test. You know that's how I do. So we'll head over there now, guys. Head over there with your boy. And I'll see you in a bit. It's your boy, Mr. Grub. Alright guys, so I went ahead and uh decided to get the uh, the oxtails, collard greens, macaroni and cheese, and rice. Uh, usually when I get soul food, I try to get like chicken or uh, meatloaf or something like that. But I was like, you know what? Let, let me mix it up a little bit. You know what I mean? See how it is. I asked him what was the best dish, and it was the oxtail, man. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and check it out, see how it is. Uh, they're a smaller establishment. It seems like, you know, uh, they're located right, right in the in the heart of Fort Pierce. Um, you know, there's only one guy in there, man. So he was kind of man in the place by himself, older guy. Um, but he was, you know, very polite. You know, asked, you know, if I needed anything else. And, you know, like I said, those 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 mom and pop places, man. It's you could you could tell it wasn't coached. Like there's no no script. You know what I mean? And, and that's my whole thing. Like, for it to feel genuine, that's what that's what I like, man. You know, genuine care for your customers. All right, so let y'all check this out. Move a little hot sauce that I had to get. You know, you can't have your greens and stuff without the hot sauce, man. So I'll let y'all check that out. See that? And that's a lot of meat, man. So... I'm gonna try my best though, guys. You know, see how it is. Put them to the test, man. You know, also got my little cornbread too. So, uh, you know, when I eat soul food like this, cornbread be my dessert. Just saying, anybody had really had room for cake and all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm gonna try with what I got, man. See if I can handle it. Got my little hot sauce, so I can put it on my, my greens. I don't, know, I don't know about y'all, man, but that's a must. You know what I'm saying? Dig into this. Mm. That's some real greens right there, man. When that uh, hot sauce, that vinegar, salt all hit you at the same time. Y'all yeah, know that feeling. Busting, huh? I always like to try my greens first. I know some people, when they make greens, they be a little sour. So I always like to try them first just to, you know, see if I like it, you know what I'm saying? Mac and cheese. Good, you know, got a little cheesy. I know y'all see it. Yeah, man. Just it tastes like that real soul food, man. <laughs> Tell you, just that I want to go to sleep, soul food. You know, y'all ain't probably had none of that in a while. But it's really good, man. I'm, I'm, I'm exceptionally impressed with the greens. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, everybody don't know how to do greens, man. So, I'm definitely impressed with the greens. It's the oxtail. You know what I say about oxtail, too? When you get oxtail with all the meat on it, that's how you know they ain't being stingy, man. Meat fall off the bone. Man. I'm telling you, 
is it right here, man. Shout out to CNC Soul Food, man. This food is really good, man. Really good. What I like about it, too, is they don't just season one part. They season everything. Like, from the mac and cheese to the greens to the meat, everything is seasoned, man. So you ain't, you ain't got to mix it and, you know, just to get that flavor. Like, everything has its own seasoning. It's really good. So shout out, shout out to them for going the extra mile, man. You know what I'm saying? Everybody won't do that. So definitely uh, check them out if you're ever in the area of Fort Pierce, man. Check them out. I definitely say it's good too if you're on lunch because you know the service the service is fast, man. You know, and the food is hot and it's fresh. Can't go wrong. When you're dealing with places like this, a lot of times the the food be sitting or something like that, like. Nah, man. I mean, it's not expensive. Usually with oxtails and stuff, is real expensive, but for the uh, oxtail dinner, it's $12. So, not only are you getting good food, but you're getting it at a very, very reasonable price. I'm telling you, a lot of people, they, they wouldn't know it because of the area. They, they kind of look over it, man. But I'm trying all of them out. I ain't, I ain't looking over nobody. So, like I said, man, it's based, you know, based on the genuine food taste, the, you know, and the, and the great energy that, that he gave off as well as the, you know, the genuine feel for the place, as well as the food, man, CNC, you get a 10 from me. Yeah, man, it's really good. So... If you guys ever in the area, man, check them out. Tell them Mr. Grub sent you. I'm gonna go on and finish this. I'll get back with you guys in a bit, man. What's your boy? Mr. Grub. Right, guys. When I tell you, oh my God. It's something about these bomb and pop places, man, especially uh, you know, in Fort Pierce, man. I've noticed they they really do a good job of their food, man. You know, they make the best out of their situation. And, you know, that's what I like, man. You know, I like people who, you know, go against the odds, man, and still push the limits. You know what I'm saying? So, shout out to CNC, Soul Food, man. Delicious, man. If you ever in Fort Pierce area, don't forget to check them out, man. You will not regret it. You hear it first here from your boy, Mr. Grub, man. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment below if you know of a place you want me to try, man. You know I'll put them to the test because that's what I do. Until next time, you guys, I'm out. It's your boy, Mr. Grub.